So here they are, Apple's new iPods, and the one that a lot of people are going to be interested in is this, the new Nano. Now, previous Nanos have been the most successful iPods that Apple have ever made, and I don't see why this one's going to be any different. Uh, as you can see, it looks a little bit like a classic, sort of squashed up, a bit smaller, and you'd be right to think that, except for the fact that it's incredibly thin, as you can see there. Uh, it borrows more than that from the classic, though. They've got the same interface, so it's split into two parts, like you can see and also there's cover flow for browsing through your artists but the real headline feature of the Nano is the addition of video playing now what makes this really cool is that it has the same resolution as the classic so the videos are going to look really really nice on that screen it might be quite small but in actual fact this has the highest pixels per inch of any Apple product ever made. It's absolutely gorgeous as you can see. You don't want to watch videos on there but for video podcasts like this it's perfect. Uh, if you're looking for something that you can carry around a lot of music in this might not be the thing. It only comes in four and eight gigabytes but if you're after something that's very pocketable then say hello to the new Nano.